<laughs> so there are too many tadpoles. We're gonna let all of them that are in here go. We just scooped out, I don't know, 50 or 100 into here. These ones we're gonna keep. And we're just gonna dump the rest of these into a bucket and take it back to where we got the eggs. Because it's too dirty and there are too many of them. To decide that the things that I tried were in my life just to get high on When I sit alone, come get a little known But I need more than myself this time Step from the road to the sea to the sky And I do believe that we rely on When I lay it on, come get to play it on All my life to sacrifice Hey, yo, oh, listen what I say, yo oh, I got your head Starting to get some legs. I don't know if you can see it, but that one's got some back legs coming on. Looks like poop. Speaking of poop, they're like poop machines. All that green is poop. The water is a lot clearer anyway, now that we reduced the population severely. They've skeletonized this piece of lettuce. I just put these lettuce pieces in a couple minutes ago. They must be able to smell it pretty well because as soon as I put it in they're right they get right on it. June tenth of 08. It's ninety-eight degrees out and it's unbelievably humid. I can hardly stand to be out here, but we're just this is the last day of a heat wave that we've been having. The tadpoles are growing bigger. Some of them are getting back legs. I'm not sure if you can see it. But you can sort of see one. Oh, just covered it. I just put this lettuce in maybe like 10 minutes ago, 10 or 20 minutes ago, and they're eating it up, they're ravenous. Trying to build up enough energy and enough fat to uh, change into tadpole, or into toads.
then once the back legs go in, the front legs will start to come in. And all the while, their tail will be shrinking. And after their front legs grow in and their tail is basically gone, we'll just let them go. Eleventh, the toad, the tadpoles are getting ever bigger, and their legs are really starting to grow in. There's one actually right there. He just went under. I don't think you can see him. Their legs are starting to really pop out, and now is a really critical time that you need to keep them fed all the time because they're really starting to store up energy. You can see that guy's legs right there. Of all times, this is the time that you can't let them run out of food. You need to keep them stocked all the time. That one has some big back legs right there. He'll probably be one of the first to come out. I'm going down to Virginia for four days, so I'll film as soon as I get back. Uh, the back legs will have gotten a lot bigger, I bet. I like growing my own lettuce because it just makes it that much fresher and the tadpoles like it a lot better. This lettuce, about 20 minutes ago I just picked off the plant and brought it inside and boiled it for 10 minutes and just plopped it in there. And I notice if you grow your own lettuce, it gets a lot greener and just more beneficial for them. June 14th, just got back from Virginia. Um, we've let two toads go already. My dad took over while I was gone. He didn't go to Virginia. And here's the log that we're keeping. So he let them go earlier today. And we'll have a final tally at the end. You can see a couple of them have front legs on them already. I figure that guy will be ready to go out tomorrow sometime, if not late tonight. There are a couple of them like that. Like that guy also. And we put the stone in here. It's like a, t a tile just so that they can climb out whenever they're ready. And some of them haven't made much progress at all. They've been eating the lettuce pretty vigorously the last week or so. It's crucial to keep them fed in their last weeks of tadpoles, of being tadpoles. The ones with front legs are still swimming, but when they do swim, they like to use their legs more to try and exercise them, I guess. Starting to walk more and swim less.